as you can tell, uh, consultations are ongoing. You ready? Are you ready, guys? Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, as always, we appreciate you coming to cover our press briefings. We have had a meeting of the Central Committee of uh, ODM, and we have a statement that we are going to make uh, on the resolutions that have been passed. So the Central Committee of the Orange Democratic Movement, meeting under the chairmanship of party leader, His Excellency Honorable Raila Molo Dinga, has today resolved as follows. Number one, that the party has officially released its officials who were recently tapped by President William Ruto for national duty as cabinet secretaries. I confirm that I have received the resignations of the Honorable John Badi as the national chairperson of ODM, the Honorable Opio Wandai as the secretary for political affairs, His Excellency Wycliffe Ambesa Oparanya, and Honorable Hassan Ali Joho as deputy party leaders of the party, and lastly, Beatrice Askul Moe, who has resigned today as a member of the party's elections committee. Secondly, we reiterate that there is no agreement of any nature between ODM and Kenya Kwanza. ODM therefore remains a member of the Azimio La Umoja One Kenya Coalition and will continue to play its role as a member of the opposition alongside other parties to push for accountability, transparency and equity in governance and public affairs. Thirdly, that in the wake of the vacancies occasioned by the nominations of these members to cabinet, the party shall be embarking on wide consultation among its membership in order to fill those vacancies. Four, that as far as, far as the vacancies in the party's parliamentary leadership occasioned by the same nominations, the party will be proposing to the Azimio PG, that's the parliamentary group of Azimio, that the Honorable Junet Mohammed take up the role of minority leader vacated by the Honorable Opio Wandai, that the Honorable Milio Diambo take up the role of minority whip, that the Honorable Caleb Amisi take up the role of chair of PSE left vacant by Honorable Mbadi, and the Honorable Oundo to take up the seat of vice chair of PIC. Five, that ODM remains committed to the idea of a national conversation to discuss the emerging issues that precipitated the ongoing crisis in the country. Lastly, the ODM fully supports the issues raised by Kenyans and particularly the Gen Z and notes that they are neither new nor difficult to understand. The issues including, but not limited to equity, unemployment, runaway corruption, were raised by Azimio last year. They also came up following the election violence of 2007-2008 and found their way into the peace accord as agenda item number four, but were forgotten as soon as normalcy returned. They have to be dealt with conclusively once and for all in a structured manner within agreed timelines. I thank you and that is the end of the statement. I have two hard copies here that we will also be supplying you with the soft copy. I will take any questions that you might have. I see there are none, which means we've been clear. Thank you very much. God bless you. Mm. We are here for the first time. And you haven't subscribed yet. Because you subscribe, if you like the video, give the thumbs up, and you can also give a comment in the comment section.